gardeners so today I'm going to be showing you guys Thaddeus my white's tree frog and I have never held him before and he's huge so I'm really crossing my fingers that he doesn't projectile pee on me because I really 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 don't want that to happen but I'm gonna go ahead and get him for you guys so that way you can see him and you guys can learn a little bit more about him so this right here is Thaddeus my white's tree frog no I'm just kidding so this is a dog, obviously. Um, I'm dog sitting him for four days and I just wanted to show him off because he's so cute. His name is Coach. He just has these super bug eyes and I absolutely adore him. So he's just hanging out with me for a few days. So I'm gonna actually go ahead and get that frog for you guys. So this right here is Thaddeus and he is my white tree frog and he is a handful. So a thing with white tree frogs or any other amphibian is if you're going to be handling it, which it's best not to, but if you have to, the best thing to do is get your hand wet before handling them because they are very sensitive and you don't want to be hurting their skin whatsoever. So Thaddeus is also known as a dumpy frog and because they're just super dumpy looking, like look at that little face. He's so cute. He just wants to look at me now. He's not peeing on me though, so I'm very happy. Um, he loves to eat. I found him at this pet store. I already kind of told you guys his story when I got him, but he was not planned whatsoever. I kind of got him because my boyfriend said we needed to rescue him from this pet store because he just was crammed in this enclosure with another frog. Apparently the other frog was really small. I didn't even see the other frog in there. I couldn't find it but he's just like this beast frog that's just there like with this other frog and literally in like maybe a one gallon enclosure he just had no space whatsoever so i had to bring this guy home because i just wanted to give him more space and give him a better life so this is him he's super cute i'm not going to keep him out the whole video because i don't want to stress him out whatsoever so other than that, me rescuing him, there hasn't really been much of an update. He has more space in his new enclosure. He loves to eat. Um, I'm trying to get him to be on like a little bit of a diet because as you can see, he just has like these folds coming over his eyeballs, which is very common for dumpy tree frogs. Um, they're very prone to obesity. So I just want him to be healthy. So I'm trying to watch what he's eating. He's definitely not getting any wax worms, that's for sure. But yeah, he's just a really sweet frog. He eats very well and he comes out at nighttime. I've heard him croaking a couple of times and I absolutely love it. He's just a little sweetheart and I love him so much. He just has like the funniest face. I just love him. So yeah, that's Thaddeus. There isn't really much to say about him other than he's just adorable and he loves to eat. So this is Thaddeus. I absolutely love this guy. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put him back in his enclosure and I'm going to put some clips at the end for you guys to see a little bit more of him. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. This right here is Thaddeus's enclosure. His water bowl is extremely dirty. He just had crickets last night and it looks like there's a dead one in there. Um, he does have a bioactive enclosure just to help keep it clean. Um, this enclosure is a container with some ventilation holes and it really really keeps in that humidity so I absolutely love it for him. Usually he sleeps in this log every single day and then at nighttime he wakes up and comes out and looks for some food. So here he is. Absolutely love this little guy.